fishing is level 47. Wow. Oh wow, look at that. I'm probably going to get kicked in a minute. What the heck? There we go. It's a little bit of lag that annoyed the crap out of me. And there we go. I'm going to have to definitely give a shout out to Sister Nicole and say I definitely agree with you in regards to not wanting to pay for any more modern day games until they get their crap together and fix them and go back to the style of video games that were actually good. So. Otherwise, if a video game is free, then yeah, sure, I'll buy the, or I won't buy it, but I'll play the video game if it's free, but I'm not going to pay you 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 dollars for a game that you're going to try to scam me out of my money on. That's just how that is, folks. Because back in my day, if you bought a video game, you owned it, not the company. And so this trash where companies think they can own everything is a joke, and they do not own everything, because legally in the court of law, again, if I were to take a company to court, this is how this works, guys. My apartment that I rent from is legally my property in the eyes of the court of the law, okay? So, guess what? I paid a one-time fee for that video game. Guess what? By law, that game is now mine. Okay, if you were to take it in the category of renters, and it doesn't matter because I'm not paying them monthly to rent their dang game, but it's just a simple flipping fact, guys. Video games back in the day, you bought them, you owned them. And that's all I'm going to say about that. These companies didn't get to scam you or me out of what we paid for, because technically that is considered a federal crime in the category of theft. And I think someone who has the money addresses these companies over this fraudulent activity they're pulling whether it be Microsoft whether it be Sony it doesn't matter I literally do think some of these games or some of these rich people like Donald J Trump for example actually put the nail in the coffin for these companies and says they're not allowed to do that that's what I think the, the government should do I think Donald J Trump and all conservatives and Republicans should basically make it clear that these companies don't own anything if they sold the item well, it's no longer their property. It belongs to the person who bought, bought that property. Um, and I look forward to seeing what Trump can do in regards to these corporations and businesses. You guys got to run your mouth. <laughs> Have fun with that. Because Donald J. Trump, in my opinion, is the only one that is worth being in office. And has been the only one being worth being in office. Because I'm sorry, I don't deal with Edo Joe. And I don't do it with a woman named Harris who cannot do her own dang job correctly. And has never really once uh, visited the border. So. But I will state this to my community who, out, who are out there and supporting me and liking the content. God bless you. Thank you. But to those out there who are just running their mouth. Guys, I really just no longer care. You guys are going to do as you please. But honestly, you're not going to be bypassing my my word count or my, my protection on my account so I will tell you this here and now good luck because any future word or any future people that run their mouth you will be ignored in regards because I will just add all your hate and all your despicable attitudes straight up into the hmm, a list of uh, words that I need to block that's just how that is guys Um, hmm. I'm not going to use that yet. 
I'll save that when I'm on a membership world. But my goal is the protection of my channel from hateful, stupid people and the protection of my community from hateful, stupid, ignorant people. Um, it's also the protection of my sanity, so I think I deal with dumbass trash. So it's just a simple fact, folks. And I believe there's too much of that in this world today, and there's not enough people who are... I didn't finish smitting you dumb game, but okay. Or stupid on the game's part, but alright, give me a minute, folks. Gotta go check something. Because that was a failure on Mark, or that was a failure on Jagex's part in that regard, and should never happen. Again, this game is absolutely horribly optimized for modern day computers, realistically. Yeah, that's video game lag and it needs to stop. Hey, Jagex, uh, whoever you new twits are, you dumb morons who took over Jagex, you guys need to fix your daggum server because this lag is going to get on my last godforsaken nerve. See this? It's lag on your part. Has nothing to do with my CPU or my processor. You guys need to severely fix your game. Wow, look at that. An issue again with Jagger Xer. Um, well, I'll quit killing my dang server and we wouldn't have an issue then. Get your crap together and stop it. Um... That is not that is not a mem member's account. It does not have a gold star beside it. Thank you. But okay. Um, West Coast, sure. Take me to the West Coast. Says, I mean, sadly, I think that's where we are here in the USA currently. So again, Jagex and the new owners need to fix their crap and stop with the horrible optimization. No matter how much I'm enjoying this game, I'm not going to tolerate incompetence on anyone's part. That stutter and that lag should never have been a thing. I don't know why Jagex thinks it needs freaking six different dang launchers open on my screen, but they need to get their crap off my screen.
I'm looking at the task manager, and one thing I'll tell you about Windows operating systems, guys, is the simple fact that they think they need to have a billion and one freaking tabs of the same tab pulled up is a horrible, disgusting joke, because back in the day, Windows 7 didn't have that crap. You opened one tab, and that was all you had open. Um, nowadays, Microsoft has just basically decided to bog down your system with a lot of illiterate bullcrap, sadly, folks. It's just how it is because Microsoft is incompetent anymore. Yes, guys, before you go running your mouth, everything I have in my system is up to date. Honestly, the only thing that I have not checked is my BIOS, because it's been about three to six months since I last updated my BIOS, because I didn't see the point in checking it, because you only update your BIOS as you need to, folks. It's a simple, solid, God-given fact. So the last BIOS update came out on 7-3-2023. Move as for you're not getting on my God bless desk and getting in front of me. I'm gonna look something up because I, I don't know exactly what that mode is. 